Hello, this video is about the use of the circle of fifth in pop songs. The, the circle of fifth is the relationship among the 12 tones of the chromatic scale. In the western music, we've got 12 different tones or keys, black keys and white keys on the keyboard. The circle of fifth actually determined the way we tune modern musical instruments. A fifth is an interval of seven semitones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And the fourth is an interval of five semitones. One, two, three, four, five. So a fifth and the four are complementary intervals because seven plus five equals to the 12 semitones of the Western music. When a song or a piece use the circle of fifth in its harmony, it will mostly go in the anti-clockwise direction. This anti-clockwise direction also called the circle of fourth. Let's go all the way down in the circle of fourth. And I will jump between octaves because I don't have enough space on my keyboard. So it will be like this. And I completed the circle and came back to C, where I started. Actually, it's very rare that you find a song that will really stick to the circle of fourth all the way. It will be more like a piano exercise or something like that. Mostly, in some point, the chord progression of the circle will break to make the harmony fit into a scale or to make some kind of a surprise effect. Let's hear a few examples. So I hope now you got some idea about the circle of fifth and the circle of fourth and the sounds that this progression is creating in a song. So please comment on this video and tell me if you find those examples useful and if you have any other questions around this topic or maybe you have more examples that you can share. Okay, see you guys soon.